I don't know. <laughs> Hello everyone. Just one moment. Just want to make sure that everything is fine. Okay, I think we're all good. Um, G'day everyone, welcome to X Recite. Oh, I'm Chrissy. Thanks for joining me. Oh, hello there. Hello, Jan, Wendy, uh, Co, uh, Christine, Barbara, um, Lindy, uh, Leslie. Hello, how are you going? Um, I know, I'm pretty sure it's Leslie, yes. Um, okay, all right. Let's, let's have a look. Okay. All right. Now, I, the um, the art that I the next project that I've got is going to be a landscape, and what I wanted to show you is that. Um, oh, good day, Coffee Cat. How you going? Nice to see you here. Thanks for popping by. Okay. So this is um, a paint. This is an idea that I had. Oh, look. It could, it's certainly more than a year ago for sure. Um, I couldn't tell you exactly how much or how, how long ago, but it's always been in my head. And this is my sketchbook. And this is where I put a lot of, or where I get a, a lot of ideas. Uh, what I do is, uh, for example, if I've got something in a, a subject in my painting, um, I always sort of, you know, um, you know put it in my sketchbook or things like that anyway so this is a landscape and of course it's a bit of a fantasy one and what I did was I actually tried it in color pencil and I've actually got the video it was actually on a live stream way back then uh, uh, um, and I tried this with color pencil and I wasn't happy with the I wasn't happy with I was fighting the paper. It actually is okay, but what I'll do is I'll actually show you the um, the color pencil bit. There it is there. So that's the color pencil one, and I hadn't finished it as you can see because it frustrated me so much. But this is sort of what it's going to hopefully look like. Oh, good day, Anne. How are you going? Nice to see you here. Thank you for uh, thanks for popping by. Um, okay, so. This is what I'm going to be doing. So I've tried it in colored pencil. Actually, it would have been nice in colored pencil, but I was fighting with the paper and it just turned me off and I just walked away from it, um, which is not what I normally do. But anyway, I decided from that time on, I didn't want to fight with my art supplies. And this one is um, in a, uh, this sketchbook is um, Stillman and Byrne. Um, 180 pound ivory cold press fabulous it's extra heavyweight so it's it's the Delta series wonderful so that is what and so I've decided then oh, I've decided that I'm going to do it and I've weakened oh actually and I also tried to do it in acrylic and that I bombed on that one so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do it on G'day Sneaks, how you going? Nice to see you. Monty, hello? Hello? Have I missed anyone? Hopefully I haven't. I think I've got everyone. Yeah, okay. So I thought, well, you know, I um, <laughs> I gave up and I'm doing it on pastel matte and I'm doing it with pastels. So it might be a little bit easier for me. But hang on, I'll just put this aside somewhere. better start recording here we go so what I did was um, this is I don't know if you can hear it can you hear my voice is that is my voice um, my microphone I forgot to I knew I forgot I knew I was good I knew I was gonna forget something okay all right okay so um, yeah so I've got board this is pastel mat board so let me see um of course you're doing it with pastels because you are the pastel queen <laughs> jelena hello on lunch way to go um yes it's good chrissy okay all right so i'm going to start and of course what i'm uh oh there's one little bit uh which 
and I've put and I've masked it with masking film now this is a little bit difficult I'm gonna get caught somewhere here and I I didn't mask these bits here because I've left it there because I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do I'll probably end up doing it well they're in the distance so that's okay and there's another one that's in the distance the trees um, Lindy says Chrissy can you explain the story of your idea you know what I think only God knows that one um, but <laughs> I would love to say I tell you what there's no oh yes the needed eraser hang on hello baby look it's here okay I've got it right in front of me and I've got <laughs> okay so um, all right so um, it's it, look it's right in front of me so I can't lose it now the story behind this uh, the story is that really that there is no story it's just that I saw one image and the image was of the the trees that you see there the trees that you see hang on let me point to it Ooh, there it is there the trees that you see there and I thought oh and these are real trees by the way they're not fantasy trees or anything like that I think are they in Madagascar I'm not quite sure I can't remember it's been a while uh, and uh, that landscape just inspired me and then my mind just went who it was just you know and I'm thinking to myself uh, it, and I just started getting pictures in my head and then I saw this um, I saw this really unusual chair as you can see that chair there it is there as you can see that chair and then I thought to myself now what would what would it look like if it had wings you know and then it, it just started building and then yeah and so sorry Lindy I wish I could say it was some kind of you know magical thing that happened in my head but I think it just it just started evolving when I was doing it so I thought okay and I didn't give up on this painting as a composition so so I hang on I better start I better talk while I'm doing this um, and of course I'm using an exacto knife and it's very sharp I changed the blade uh, someone ought to keep an eye on that eraser says <laughs> Oh gosh um, it's just that she has crazy thoughts flying through her head I think it would be fun to run around in her head and see these thoughts oh my gosh it looks like it's uh, from uh, a Disney movie or something it could be and you see these um, funny horses that aren't really horses they're just like a well they sort of have the shape of a horse but they're not going to be normal <laughs> what else not normal yeah, well that's right it's horses on it's horses on stilts actually yes um, <laughs> what else would it be so so here we go so I'm very and you know what this is such a light hand I'll just put that somewhere there Just yeah, I'm just have to just concentrate a little bit here, so I don't. Um... Is that music too loud? No. Tell me. Okay. Okay. All right, nearly there. Yeah. And see so if you miss a little corner, here we go. Now this is not going to affect my drawing whatsoever. So I know I know I know you guys have seen me do this, but I do get questions about it all the time. So I just thought I'd just do the, just this little bit here. Yeah, I think we're done. So I just has anyone used um, used um, I know I, I know Wendy has uh, has anyone used the masking film at all Andrea hello nice to see you here nice to see you here um, okay. 
Okay, sorry guys, just, yeah, oh, this is, I've just got to be careful, that's all, I've just got to be real careful. I mean, this paper's fantastic, but, you know, you just, you know, I still take care of it when I'm working. Oh, you can imagine, I had covered this whole, this whole, um, uh, surface with um, uh, with this masking film uh, when when I f well I, I filmed it so you'll get to see it when um, when eventually um, I'll do the the video of it but I covered th this whole bit now I'm so impatient you have no idea like I'm really impatient now but I've just got to be real careful <laughs> Oh, g'day, Iris. How you going? I wonder what art supplies we are getting from Santa. Well, I'm always, well, Santa's always buying me art supplies. Um, but what's Santa buying you for art supplies? Um, uh, Wendy says she's getting none. Well, you've got a new art room. There you go. That's, that's something. Well, can't wait. Um, I'm sure, I know Wendy's mentioned it, but just to remind everyone, Wendy's been redecorating. <laughs> redecorating. <laughs> oh, look, how impatient can I be? Sorry, folks. I didn't think it was going to give me that much How frustrating. Look at this. Okay. Patience. Oh, finally. Here we go. <clears throat> okay. Um, you already have two... Oh, hang on. Uh, who got art supplies from Cyber Monday? Oh, no. I heard about that. I heard about... And look, I've missed here. Oh, gosh. I'm not going to be happy about this. This... Now this lady here, well, this lady is not your normal lady. What else? Um, she's she's part of the. Um, you could say that she's part of the landscape. She's got roots for legs, or like really, her body will turn into. She's sort of like a tree lady. That's what she is. Um, I might get some pastels or watercolors. Ooh, um, needs to get pass. Uh, needs to start passing some out of her extra. Oh, hang on a sec. Have I missed something? Um, I might get some pastels or watercolors. Says Iris. Um, I um, I would have already been in hospital if I were doing that. Oh, you mean like with the knife? You mean? maybe oh yeah cutting yourself but you know what tell you what practice you'll end up getting good at it but you see I wouldn't do it on um, uh, I, I, I'm a bit scared to do it on certain surfaces so I've already tried it on watercolor paper a hot press and uh, that didn't go so well um, but you know what? I'm going to have another crack at it, so of course I will. And I think we're just about right here. Oh. Okay, hang on. Nearly there. All right, okay. We're ready to go. <clears throat> oh, Brenda! Hello! Nice to see you! <laughs> G'day mate to you as well. Um, okay, I'll send... Oh, okay. All right. Here we go. Now, oh, the art supplies that I have around me are... Okay, I might just um, switch this one off for the moment. My flying chairs. I've got... Pan pastels. I've got my soft tools. Well, this is from... Look, it's still. Um, I've got some spares if I need them. 
sharpeners, kneaded eraser. <laughs> Don't move from where you are. <laughs> um, sharpeners and all that stuff. Okay, so here we go. Okay. All right, here we go. Oh, yep. Oh, hang on a sec. That's that. Look, yeah, no, that's fine. Let me see. Um, quick question. Are the Caran d'Ache pastel pencils any good? Now, that is on my list. I think Santa will be buying those ones for me. Uh, yes, they are. Um, sn um, yes, Iris. Under the horse's belly. Oh, look. I missed. Oh, look. Aren't you guys good? Yes, you are so good. I'm going to have to do. There it is. Oh, my gosh. Just when I thought I got everything. Uh, Marion, hello. Welcome, welcome. Uh, evening, Chrissy. Hi, all. Thought I'd pop in while, uh, while I have a cup of tea, but then it'll be bedtime. Oh, look, that's okay. Make that cup of tea last for a long time. <laughs> wow, thank you so much for that, Sneets. <laughs> Okay, uh, let me see. I think that's all right. This is all going to be greenery, greenery, greenery. And this is going to be the lake. And you'll see there's reflection. You can see all of that. Okay, all right. So, I'm thinking this is the, uh, the ultramarine blue. Yeah, the ultramarine blue. I might mix it up with um, some of the others here. Let me see. Um, uh, we have good eyes, yes. Um, okay. Um, they are the only one. Are they? Uh, uh, they are the only one that I could find. Uh, open stock in my local store. Of course, they are the most expensive. Yes. I want to buy the whole set. <laughs> I don't want to just stop at one with those ones. Um, yeah. You know what, Iris? Just buy. Just a handful at a time. I would buy a handful at a time. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I've heard some very good um, reports on them. So, um, but you know, okay. All right, here we go. I can hardly see that actually. Okay. All right. Um, uh, Chrissy, look again at the horse. Are you sure it's done because the legs look like there's still a piece to be cut out? Uh, that bit there, that bit, uh, oh, jeepers creepers. Oh my gosh, you are so right. Look at that. Yes, you are so right. Gosh. Talking about an eye for detail. Bloody good. <laughs> oh, actually, there's that bit there too. Yes. Oh. There's that as well. Oh, come on. Oh. Okay. Please, everyone, check to see, make sure that there's nothing else. And let me just get to this bit. Sorry, I just got it. It's caught. I didn't get all of it. Oh, look at that. Okay. See if there's anything else. I think we are right now. I think. Um, okay. All right. I think we're okay now. 
mind you I actually I chat I think I said it I change the blade every time I I use this on a project and it's probably overkill but um, as you can see I just don't want to uh, ruin what I'm doing here so hang on so am I good to go folks <laughs> um, thanks it seems a bit pricey oh, let me see the um I'm going to go a bit darker here. Yeah, that's it. All right. Okay, so. So what I'm using is the ultramarine. Yeah, I'll go here. as I go down okay so this is a board again like I mentioned before uh, I I'm not it doesn't feel the only difference that I'm feeling is that it's a bit more rigid and that's it um, yeah Uh, wait, Chrissy. One spot below the tree, bit, uh, below the tree lady's left arm. That you mean? Oh gosh, my gosh. Hang on, let me see my reference photo. I'm not quite sure. Just give me two minutes, two seconds. Just want to have a look because. Because I think, yeah, it is two. Oh, gosh. There it is. It's there. And there. Oh, my gosh. I ended up now oh, thank you so much for that <laughs> okay have another look please <laughs> I think we're right now I think we're right now okay I'll just put this aside okay I used to make us get them at work every everyone always got coals after oh yes see it's winter time over there now approaching anyway sorry uh, for you guys um so what inspired this project hmm uh, <laughs> well i don't know what happened i think i must have had an epiphany but it all started off with the trees this was the <laughs> um this is the photo or this is that's the chair those trees that's what started it all that one and it uh, I just built from there I couldn't tell you what was going on I've this this particular um, uh, composition I put together more than a year ago I couldn't tell you how long ago okay um, and this sponge is absolutely fantastic for doing this kind of thing I hold it it's I like the way I'm holding it I don't need to squish it because you know there's the big round one and stuff like that so this sponge is really good for this so um approaching with six inches of snow the last couple of days oh wow well i tell you what well it's i mean the weather's today it rained cats and dogs but we've been having some lovely weather so yeah oh look that came off mm. by mistake um so 
Now this is our last month of spring. And now my son is wanting pool parties <laughs> and things like that. Or well, not pool parties. We, I said to him, they're not, they're not parties. They're going to be gatherings, get-togethers. There'll be none of that. <laughs> so. Uh, what I'll do is... Okay. Uh, all the pieces come from your imagination. Um, yeah, they just... It, it, this one evolved. This one evolved. Usually I get a picture in my head and I go hunting, but um, this one evolved. I saw a few pictures which or images that I liked and they just started getting... Now look, see these here? I'm not sure what I want to do, so that's why I've... Um, um, I'm not sure what I want to do with those, but I'll know that they're there. And I'll probably put them in. I'm just not sure what I want to do. I, I drew it in, but not sure um, I'm so envious um, I want summer back oh gosh I hate winter too I hate it oh and I lucky that you guys saw these bits see look this is the idea the whole idea of doing this um, very impressive. Oh, thanks. Nice imagination, Chrissy. Oh, okay. Uh, should see it work. Sometimes when I show them uh, some of the images that, or some of the paintings that I've been doing, they always look at me and they go, really? What were you thinking? W what were you on? <laughs> go, well. Well, you see, they're, they're um, electrical engineers, you know, they're not artistic people. They would not know how we all think, would they? <laughs> um, Singapore is warm, 24-7, no winter at all. Oh, wouldn't that be good? And see, that's the idea of masking film. Now, I, I also got this on a roll which I wanted to show you. This is the, when you get it on a roll, again, it's mask it, so you can get it in the sheets and you can get it um, in the roll. So, of course, I bought a ton of it because I love it so much. Um, okay. So... Have you guys, what projects have you been doing? Have you been doing anything that you can share with us all? Um, um, I'm waiting, uh, I, um, I'm waiting the good snowy times, uh, eight below, but, uh, but hasn't snowed yet. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Mask it. Nice one from, from the mask. <laughs> no, it's from Express It. That's the brand. Steve, hello, mate. How are you going? I can only stay for about half an hour, but I wanted to. I wanted to. I wanted to start out by my day with, with, with Express Art. How are you? Well, that's it. Thank you very much for that. That's very nice of you. Good day, Jeff. How are you going? Nice to see you, mate. Um. This is going to take a while, so bear with me with this. I wanted to, what I wanted to do is once I get, once I finish uh, the sky and the clouds, I actually wanted to um, uh, to do perhaps maybe the trees, and I'll start and I'll. I'm not going to do that yet because that requires a lot of detail, and I won't be able to concentrate with my light with the live stream, so. So I'll just keep on working this. Okay. Um, uh, doing random art recently, but today I'm using the stream to draw my comic again. I saw one of your posts, Coffee Cat. Yes, while I'm listening to you. Wonderful. Um, haha, cool. I would welcome you, uh, Wendy and Chrissy, to Singapore with open arms. Oh, yes. 
Well, we'll have to one day. Oh, there's so much traveling that I want to do. I'd love to visit all of you guys. That would be wonderful. See you all in person. That would be nice. Um, I finished... Okay. Um... Oh, okay. Uh, Christy, when you are ready to take off the film, why not start peeling from the bottom? I've noticed you always start from the top. To be honest, Jelena, I'm not sure. Uh, I suppose... That's a very good question. I think it's just the way I'm doing it. I don't think there's there's no... You can. I suppose you could peel from that way. You could. Um... That's a very good question. I never even thought of that. Uh, there's no real technique. It's just getting the um, masking film off the um, off the surface. So, but look, isn't it great that I can just do this and not have to worry about going around uh, my subjects? That's just the best. That's the best, best, best about this whole thing. Um, okay. Um, I did an acrylic painting for a friend who is getting baptized this Sunday. Oh, wonderful. Oh, acrylics. That's another thing I want to... Um, well, you know, acrylics and I don't really get on too well. I love acrylics. I bought acrylics because there's no way in the world it's going to beat me. I, I, want to, uh, I want to really get good at it. So, But... Um, they they dry on me um g'day robin nice to see you hello there thanks for popping by um oh g'day paulo how are you going um ira says um i'm working on a piece about the um androgynous myth uh myth about the origin of love oh very nice can't wait to see that um uh steve yep 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 oh okay um, okay, I'm just going to keep on layering, keep on going. Okay. Brenda says, I love acrylics. I love acrylics. I don't love me. But that's okay. We'll, um, I'll try to, um, there's no way in the world that I, I should be able to, um, you know, to, I, I mean, I know people prefer one thing over another. For example, acrylics over an oils. Because acrylics, I know they dry real fast, but they dry too fast for me. That's, that's my problem. Um, okay. Okay. Um, Got to use water or acrylic mediums to keep the acrylic painting moving. Yes, I know. I know. And I've got all the mediums. I have got, I've got so much. I've got so much. But yes, uh, Brenda. Oh, thank you, Brenda. Um, are those clouds? Uh, if so, uh, they look magical. I wouldn't. At the moment, I'm just, um, all I'm doing is just putting down the pastel and I'll come through with the white. But yes, actually quite misty, doesn't it? It looks quite misty. Um, uh, I want you, um, yeah, okay. Uh, Christine says, uh, my friend's mom just passed and I'm wondering uh, what I can do for him. Uh, uh, what a thoughtful idea. Um, oh, okay. I'm about to do a waterfall scene in acrylics. It's my next piece uh, once I finish Christine's black dog. Oh, wow. Um... Sneak says, um, uh, do you think that your sponge would work well with graphite? Graphite powder? Graphite. It, it should. If you apply it, if you apply it, I, if you apply it, I suppose, yeah. 
it'd be um, instead of using your fingers I suppose if you're smudging a bit through or instead of using um, the tortillions I suppose yeah these are so and they're so dense too that's the thing um, um, the only thing that acrylic does is that it dries on the darker tone um, does the does the acrylic uh, does the that's, this is one oh, just the question just flew out of my head that's right does do the acrylics dry a different color when they dry um, I don't think I've had too much experience with them to know that that's the thing I'm sure the acrylic painters in here would be able to answer that question um, yes I want uh, let me see um, yes I want to try and do the waterfall all around the same time at least wait to share at the same time oh okay must have missed something there um, Okay, uh, graphite um, is so much fun. Actually, I'm, you know what? Believe it or not, I was been thinking of graphite pencils too. I've been thinking to to do maybe something, but I'm not sure. Thing is, I love color too much. That's the thing, you know. So, all right. Still going. That's going to be lighter here, and I'll just go darker up the top. I'm just mixing this here. See, this is a good size too. This is um, it's more than 30 by 40 centimeter. I didn't measure it. Um, certainly, it's probably about well, I don't know, probably about 50 centimeters. I reckon by about, I'll, I'll have to measure it, I'll, I'll, but this is a good size. Uh, one amazing, okay, uh, one amazing about acrylics is that you can paint it on any surface, yes. Um, I don't enjoy acrylics um, or oils, uh, my son likes them. Uh, watercolour is fun though, yes, yes. Um, Oh, for those who have come in late, I just wanted to show you, um, I've actually done this painting quite a few times, and this is my sketchbook, and this is where I've painted this in watercolour. So there you go, that's what, that's the gist of the painting. There you go. Um, uh, for that, yeah. Actually, how did I do that? That's pretty good. Um... Okay, um, uh, there's something about uh, black and white portraits. I know you would uh, you would be great at them. Oh, thanks, Iris. Yeah, look, I'm willing to try everything. Um, I, I posted an octopus graphite. <laughs> uh, I posted an octopus on unmasked. Um, Unmasked Family. It's my first graphite project. Um, I decided I need better pencils because uh, all of them, all of, of all the nuggets in them. Oh, okay. So what are the best brands to get? Um, Ma uh, Marion says, Chrissy, um, is this image a part of your playing card series? No, it's not. I'm practicing for... Um, this is um, a landscape. Now, I'm, what I'm doing is, um, for my cards, I'm actually going to do a gigantic, a gigantic landscape. It'll be all the four realms, fire, air, earth, and water. And it'll all be, like, they'll all sort of mix into one. And before I tackle that one, because I'm actually, I'm feeling a bit intimidated, actually, by it. But I don't even know why I put this pressure on myself. But 
it it helps me learn and it helps me improve when I go um, when I just you know do something that I don't normally do so to answer your question it's a landscape because I want to practice landscapes but it's in the theme you know the fantasy theme that I always enjoy doing but it's it's just a bit like the um, my fantasy galaxy um, thing that I did um, just you know uh, practicing on landscapes and stuff like that but after this one I'm going to do a few of my aces which are more simple than the other portraits that I did or well, sorry that I've been doing um, but yes so and the, the big one is going to be um, what is it I think it's about a hundred centimeters by about se um, uh, 70 centimeters huge like a, a meter that's just yeah so there you go uh, okay uh, let me see let me see oh all right um, let me see um, Oh, okay, a pink car. All right, let me see. All right, okay, my sketchbook. This is where I sketch, sorry. This is where I sketch ideas. This is what you mean. <gasps> Whoa. This is uh, watercolor and a bit of gouache. This is um, a cute little card. Now, after I finish my cards, um, this is going to... I've got another big project. And so I was playing around with ideas about a book. And this is going to be one of my characters. Um, another one that's going to be in my characters. Let me see if I've got it here somewhere. Yes, I have. So this is, oh, uh, this is me playing around. Hang on a sec, where is it? Where's the other one? Oh, there's another one. But this one doesn't have fancy eyes. There's another one. I was just playing with colours and stuff like that. So that's what that's all about. Um, yeah. Yeah. So if I've got ideas, I, I put it in my sketchbook. Um... Let me go back. Uh, this must be fantastic. Oh, let me see. Um, uh, this must be Fantastic Beasts and the Flying Chairs. Oh, I like that title. <laughs> I like that. I find that having a fine mist spray bottle and distilled water is great too while the paint, uh, while you paint with acrylics. Yes, because that way it doesn't dry, eh? Um, oils is wonderful for painting portraits. Oh, yes. Yeah, and I've got some wonderful portraits which I actually want to start painting with oils. And I'm, and that's what I wanted to ask. Um, would you guys mind if I, um, you know, because I know you guys all, all you all see me doing um, pastels all the time, but I'm actually an oil painter, so um, I might might do some oils every now and again. Um, uh, that that background is looking all uh, awesome already. I'm so. Um, uh, jelly right now oh okay um, I just finished a purple and blue butterfly in color pencils oh wonderful Barbara that's lovely uh, Robin says uh, you have to invest in the uh, Lumograph Mars pencils um, that are graphite carb mix okay uh, they accept charcoal so much better than uh, the graph uh, the graphite alone and there is no shine oh I might have to write that one down or I have to I have to remember L Lumigraph. Wow. Okay. I uh, hope you're able to have an exhibition with them uh, when they are all finished. Uh, that would be awesome. Yes. Oh, of course I will. I'm actually going to have like a little roadshow uh, with my cards, and there'll be prints, and um, there'll even be like a little booklet um, describing all the characters, because all the characters. Um, uh, in, uh, in my card series have got a personality so but the one thing I will tell you is that all the four queens and there is a story um, all the four queens 
the four queens are sisters. And of course, you know what? You've got the evil one and then you've got the really goody two-shoes one. And, you know, they're all got, you know. So, and some of them have got, um, like, they've got uh, special, um, like, magical powers or fantasy powers. So, yes. So... Okay. Okay. Um, um, uh, let me see. Um, the car looks like uh, it came from Who Framed Roger Rabbit? <laughs> um, uh, yeah, it does look like that. I've actually got some um, other ones as well, so which I haven't um, um, paint or you know painted them all out or drawn them out yet. Um, Oh, that's old Bumblebee, <laughs> says Co. Um, uh, re re okay, uh, paints, um, let me see. I uh, really love the car, says Christine. Uh, paints, I, um, I can thin them uh, to the consistency and uh, I want, but not thicken them. Okay. Um, oh, I don't mind watching an oil painting episode. Oh, really? Um, what brand? Um, okay. Oh, that's wonderful. Arteza paints. I got. I got. They are great. Uh, co or a series. Um, uh, do your thing, Chrissy. You will just reach out and inspire um, even more artists. Oh, thank you so much, Chrissy. You might be the next Bob Ross. <laughs> I doubt it. <laughs> oh, oh, well, yeah. I should get the afro, shouldn't I? Oh, funny. Um, Robin says, um, they are Stedler pencils. Okay, all right. I will keep that in mind. Thanks. Um, all right. Next, I need to finish the pastel landscape that Will did just before his vacation. Well, he should be back soon, shouldn't he? Um, the Queen of Clubs was giving me all the feelers. I feel like I need to know her life story. She's just so interesting. Well... I'll tell you a little bit about her though. She is, she talks to the animals. She is the queen, she is the earth queen of clubs and she talks to the animals, she communicates and she is probably the most down to earth of all the queens. The, the queen of spades, she's evil, beautiful but evil. Um, the queen of hearts, um, a bit... Um, a bit conceited actually but she's harmless um, and uh, the the diamonds uh, the queen of diamonds she's the youngest and she's the air queen um, and she's always you know out and about not in her realm she likes to she likes to move around in her realm she's not sorry in her she's not in her castle and stuff like that um, Simon hello nice to see you here first time uh, thank you for popping by g'day g'day um, if you um, if you uh, play your cards right Chrissy um, uh, you will be the next Bob Ross <laughs> okay all right um, yes all right okay I'm actually gonna put some clouds in here now for the moment maybe I'm not quite happy yet Still looks a bit blotchy. Might smooth. Oh, look at that. Oh, might smooth it out. Okay. Um, I remember that. I remember that liquid white and the black gesso. How does Bob Ross say? Say it. Beat the devil out of it. Uh, then he cleans his brushes. Okay. Oh, okay. Me and the Queen of Clubs uh, need to become friends right now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. All right. I still feel like it needs more pastel, though. I shouldn't really rush because, you know, it's still a bit blotchy for me. I'll start from the bottom and I'll work my way up again. Well, it is a big piece, isn't it? So... Um, Simon says, um, uh, it is indeed, uh, great to see you as well, um, uh, as usual, loving your work. Oh, thank you so much. Well, you've got some lovely work. I've seen, I've seen your work on Instagram. Um, terrific stuff, actually. 
Actually, so many artists here. So many artists do so many beautiful things here. Oh my gosh, every one of you. I've seen most of your work, I think, um, which is fantastic. So, you know, we can all share tips, perhaps. Tips and tricks. See, I mean, already people were helping me here. So I didn't miss out. All they said, it. look at that. I'm so glad that you guys picked that. Oh, Sneaks picked it out, actually. Yep. Oh, and I think, I think maybe Wendy picked a few things up as well. Okay, here we go. I'm working my way up. That's all going to be just a little bit lighter down there. Um, Kimberly, good day. How you going? Nice to see you here. Nice to see. Look, see, I'm actually working, and not not working instead of just gas bagging all the time. Um, this paper is working great with the stormy effect. Yeah. You can imagine how many layers this is going to take. This can take heaps of layers. Let me see. Uh, why are you going with the stormy appearance instead of um, uh, a sa oh, say a sunset? Well, it's not a stormy. It's not stormy. That's why... I'm continually trying to um, even out these um, the pastel, the pan pastel. I still, I still need to put heaps of layers down. I mean, who knows? This might even be a mixed media. It all depends. I'll see how I go. Um, there's so much detail. Yeah. Who knows, I might do some colour pencil. But as you can see, oh gosh, might have to use my um, makeup brushes to soften all of this up. Um, I'm sorry I missed uh, you finishing the Queen of Clubs. It's lovely. Oh, no problem. All good. Um, uh, these creatures should be called chair to flies. Chair to, chair to flies. Actually, I like the other name that you gave it. That that other, I'm going to have to go back and um, have a look at that one later on. Um, I've been working pastels all month, but today I'm back to coloured pencils and it feels like a foreign world. You'll be much slower with coloured pencil, I would assume, of course. But, you know, I've got, um, I want, there are so many projects that I want to do. Oh, gosh. If you only knew the late nights that I've had. Oh my gosh. Um, I've been working pastels. Oh yeah, now we've seen that. Uh, since the trend lately is laying coloured pencil on top of the pastels, you should demonstrate that technique. I could. <laughs> I could. <laughs> <laughs> um. All right, okay. But yeah, I can, you know what my favorite part about this is when I start to peel peel this all back. I wonder if I can use um, just wanted to see the brushes. Hmm. Yeah, I'm finding that it's smoothing it out real nicely, actually. I've got, I didn't anticipate this. So I've got a really thick brush for this, actually. I didn't bring it. Maybe I should. I'll leave this here for the time being. I just need to apply more pastel, that's all. Um, sorry, Chrissy, you may have mentioned this earlier. Are you using pastel mat? Yes, I'm actually using pastel mat board. Um, and uh, this board is terrific. 
uh, really is. I uh, hope all is going well with... Oh, okay. Um, okay. Okay. I want to smooth this out because it still looks a bit blotchy. Okay, maybe when I start putting the clouds in, it won't look so blotchy. And the clouds are not going to be puffy clouds. They're probably... Ah, again. All right. Let's see. Does it look blotchy to you? I think it looks blotchy to me still. Okay. Uh, um... Okay, um, okay, nice, says um, Simon. Uh, Chrissy, the Queen of Pastel Mat. <laughs> I know, oh, look, I know, look, you know what? I've tried so many papers and I continue to try paper. In fact, I love paper, I love paper a lot. But, and I've tried, and you guys have seen me try many papers, right? And I keep on showing you that I've bought papers. Actually, sweet, uh, speaking of papers, um, um, but pastel mat seems to be the thing. Um, Wendy says, uh, uh, Chrissy, do you find the board to be slightly different feel than the paper? You know what it is? It's actually allowing me to put uh, it do, um, more layers, I think. I think. Because I think with the paper, I would have been right by now. Or maybe it's the size. But it, it's a harder surface. But still allowing um, the like the pastel's just wonderful going on. Okay. Um, Kimberly says, I use those exact same makeup brushes when I'm working with charcoal. Yes, oh yeah, oh look. <laughs> there are so many things you can do, hey. So many things. Um, Christine says, uh, uh, you have been turning out a lot of paintings late. Oh, okay. Oh, that's for Brenda, sorry. Um, maybe it's just you. Maybe it's just me. Yes, maybe it is Wendy. Okay. All right. Okay, now before I go into clouds, somebody asked, um, I had a question. I had a question about because um, we were talking about papers I had a question I oh, love the sky oh thanks Chrissy um, are the big summer uh, flies out in Australia already yes yes they are buzzing around sometimes they come into my studio when I when I walk in uh, you know Gary struggled with pastel mat board yes I know he did I know he did um, love the sky okay uh, I had a question about uh, Bristol smooth and the question was is that um, that uh, the person who was asking me uh, thought that uh, Strathmore were the only ones that make Bristol smooth. And I said, no, in fact, um, there's a few other companies that make Bristol smooth. So I thought, I thought, well, I'll show you anyway. Um, here we go. Bristol smooth, and uh, we all know. Um, see, we've got here we go. Uh, there's the Strathmore. That's the Bristol Smooth. Then there's the Bristol Vellum. Right? We all know about that, right? But, and that's Strathmore. Okay. Um, I just want to put this safely here. But, there is also Fabriano make Bristol. There we go. And this one's 250 GSM. And this one comes in, um, uh, is in a pad of 20. So there you go. For illustrators, there you go. Um, graphic arts and design illustration arts. So that's Fabriano. Look at that. And then there is also, now, and I know that I've actually showed you guys um, as well with one of my purchases. My favourite pastel mat people. Look at that. Claire Fontaine make Bristol. So there you go. So, um, well, this is, you know, 
so I can't be I can't I can't be accused of just using pastel matte but you know so there you go I thought I'd just um, share that um okay um, all right Um. Okay. okay, okay, all right. Um, I saw Jason Morgan do a review on pastel mat, uh, says Christine, uh, but I think it was pastel card, maybe. Um, and if it got wet, the tooth uh, slid right off the board. Um, I can't remember which which it was, though. Yes, it's the pastel card, pastel card by Sennelier. Uh that's the one that if liquid gets on there or so, sorry water water gets on there um, that's when the paper comes off not the pastel mat you can do washes on pastel mat no problem in fact i've i've, I've got a video on on uh, pastel card by sennelier and i did um like i used a colored pencil i used pastels i used um a variety of mediums and i showed you uh, what happens I use I think I used oil pastels as well um, and what happens when you and pan pastels the only liquid that I found that did not destroy the surface was zested when I was blending so there you go but yeah no pastel card by sennelier pastel mat board no problem all right Just, I just want to make sure that it's not blotchy. Oh, look, there's a bit of a halo here, I think. Uh. I just have to make sure that there's no halos. Gee, really working this. See, this is why I'm practicing landscapes. I'm open for ideas, everyone. <laughs> okay. Um, the picture could be a place where dragons could live and all kinds of mythical creatures. Oh, is are we talking about um, this one or are we talking about my cards, Co? Um, oh, this one here. No, 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 well, no dragons, but flying chairs. <laughs> um okay um i'll put uh okay oh thank you for that no look that's okay um oh this one yeah no 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 dragons in this one although i should have put i should put dragons in my um elements though i mean that's a fantasy world as it is all right all right I'll just have a look at my reference. Um, I use similar sketchbooks. Um, uh, they're cheaper and easier to cart around. Also, I don't feel guilty when I get coffee stains on the covers. Oh, that's all right. I know, but a dragon could be um, uh, could be nearby. Anything is possible, Co. Anything is possible. Um, I just want to get my... Um, oh, where is it? I just want to... Okay, here we go. I think I need it's I think I need something let me see. I don't want to put just white here. Okay, I'll leave that here. Here's another sponge. And I'm using I'm not gonna use white just yet. Uh you think I'd know this off by heart. Raw under tint, serious. Okay. Not quite. Okay. Um, oh, good day, Helly. How are you going? Nice to see you. Welcome, welcome. Um, 
Helly, um, it's cold in Denmark right now, so I enjoy sitting in my couch uh, with my blanket on and watching a live video. Oh, that's nice. Thank you so much for that. Um, yeah. Uh, okay, Coffee Cat. Um, Got to bounce, Chrissy, uh, but I hope you have a great rest of the stream. Bye, everyone. Oh, bye for now, Coffee Cat. Thanks for popping by. Okay. All right. Okay. Uh, I'm doing it light just at the horizon to show uh, distance that's what I'm doing and I didn't want to um, use white um, okay I think that's smoothing out now which is much better just goes to show I just need to keep on layering Um, okay, I uh, was thinking about doing, um, oh, okay, oh, live Facebook reveal of my new, oh, yes, that would be great, Wendy, um, what is everyone, oh, yeah, go ahead, oh, yeah, absolutely, um, yes, yes, yes. She's been teasing us all with a new studio. Um, we'll post pics on Instagram and we'll have an official studio tour on YouTube after the first of the year. We're all looking forward to that. Yeah, because I'm going to do one too soon. Um, my time, I don't know when I'm going to have time to do it though. I'll just show you some of the storage. But my, my, my studio or my little art space is um, not as organized as some. Okay, I'm just, just having a look to see. All right. Okay, this is where I now start to put some clouds in, I think. Alright, I'll put that aside. And I will get the white now, when I can find it. So here we go. Um, and I'm going to use brushes and all sorts of things like this. So. And these aren't going to be puffy at all. You know, the ones that are... Marion, uh, spun the cupper out. <laughs> As, out as long as possible, Chrissy. I've got to go and hit the hay. Oh, nice. Oh, look, thank you so much for popping by. Um, that's lovely. Thank you. Good night for you. Uh, sneaks. Um, I like the glow you're going, uh, you're getting on your background. Nice. Yes. And I didn't use white. That's the thing. It was the raw umber tint. So, um, Yeah, these ones are not going to be puffy at the moment. So, uh, well, that's how it is in my reference. They're not puffy clouds. So, I'll see how I go. Uh, 
and again I mean how good is that but you see these little in the chairs that's got to be sky but I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do that maybe that will be covered I'm not sure um I can come up with a few oh okay all right yeah just looking at my reference and creating a bit of distance doing it this way for the time being And of course, you know, I'll be touching it up, I don't know, all the time. Walking away. Um, and there's some dark clouds as well, which I'm going to... Um, looks like there's some dark clouds in my reference. Um, Uh, a grey, let me see. More of a grey. Um, just where's my bit of paper? Oh, I do have paper there. Always losing paper. Um, let me see. Um, Christine says, uh, it looks it looks like velvet. Oh <laughs> it does, doesn't it? They're easy to work with. Um Kenny G is playing his saxophone in the background. <laughs> Oh, so funny. This kind of looks, um, if Dali was born in Greece, there you go. So many people say that about some of this. And of course, I am inspired um, uh, by Dali. I just um, think his, his work is really out there. Not some of the really weird stuff, but some stuff I really like. Um, Iris says, uh, Chrissy, help me scold Wendy for not making any new videos. Oh, well, you see, she's been busy with her art studio. That's why. Um, uh, that's the um, that's the excuse I'm going to um, help her with. <laughs> um, uh uh, we keep each other motivated and accountable. Otherwise, we would never do anything. Yes, absolutely. Oh, don't you worry. I do. Um, I do tell her what she's, you know, hurry up. Yeah, what she's not doing, actually. Yes, not doing. Okay, there we go. Okay. There's some dark clouds. Yep. And the reason why I put it on paper is because I don't want the full... Ah, what can I say? Sorry. I'm using Payne's Grey Extra Dark. And I don't want to use the full force of that. So I just do, do it like... You know, just put it on my paper so I don't use all the pigment. Gosh. Yes, so it's not so saturated. Okay. Um, uh, oh, Jelena. Oh, who's going? Who's going? Is oh, oh, Jelena. Have to go. Bye for now. Oh, thank you so much for popping by, Jelena. Um, hope to see you again soon. Um, okay, Paulo says, don't take me wrong, Chrissy. I love Dali and his imagination. Oh, okay, no, that's all right, no way. Um, all good. But I've had, I've got, if you've, if you go through some of my, um, some of my other artwork, I've got like an elephant sitting on a tree. I mean, that's Dali ish. Every, every, or that's, or, um, a lot of people say, say that sometimes as soon as they see that, that one. Okay, all right. Um, oh, it was meant as a compliment. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, no, all good. All good. All good. Um, 
Iris says, Chrissy, don't make excuses too. Come on, we've got we've got a team up for 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 once. She's on the other side of the skull. Yes, I know, I know. Don't you worry. Here we go. Oh, okay, let me see. Alright. Now I will be fixing skies. Actually, I'm liking the way that that's going. Okay, all right. Okay, all right, so I'm good with this. Uh, uh, you mean getting rid of the excess? Hmm? Uh, elephant on a tree, Dumbo. <laughs> um, well, you should see it, actually. Uh, you should see it. Um, he's quite cute, actually. Um, I think it would be fun to try and do a painting uh, in the style of Renoir, but I wouldn't have a clue how to start. Well, you just start. Nike. Nike, Christine. Nike. Um, Steve says, Chrissy, I was just thinking, I bet Will would be proud that through him, it seems, the family continues uh, through you and Christine. Would um, would have been uh, Wendy too, but she likes falling down. Oh, I know, poor thing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes, I know. I know. It's okay. Don't worry. She's going to get back on the horse soon. Um, uh, <laughs> Iris says, "Oh, right, Wendy says you crack me up. Bring it on, girlfriend. Um, I can take a good. I can. I can take as yes, as good as as I can give. Absolutely. That, that's all gang up on her. Okay. Um, <laughs> uh, you are so right, Steve. Okay. Uh, yeah. Just do it." Christine, see? Nike, Nike, Nike. Um, uh, Got to start small and start somewhere, Christine. Absolutely. Uh, Kimberly, now that you've added the Payne's Grey, uh, the blue of the sky is, start, uh, is standing out more. Yes, there you go. There you go. Um, that looks like a hand, doesn't it? Coming out, but um, it's actually um, a tree. I'm going to build that out. It's like a, you know, the landscape just goes out so there you go well look I'm gonna leave that for the moment and I'm actually gonna start on the tree how about that I'm gonna leave these two guys here because I'm not quite sure um, and I need a bit of concentration and, I'm, and I need to think about it so what I'll do is I'm going to cut here um, oh my gosh now I can't find my blade <laughs> oh hang on no 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 here I found it Oh, here we go. It's going to be like the needed eraser, folks, but we found it very quickly. <laughs> um, okay, so. Actually, it's... Okay, let's go this one. Hang on. Come on. Actually, that can go as well, so that's fine. Um, and this is part of the wing or part of the chair, so I don't want to um, do anything with that. Yeah, just got to be careful that I don't cut the paper. It's always such a delicate process. Look, check that out. Oh, that is so cool. I love doing that. That's one of my favourite parts. Well, you know, when it cuts off. Oop. Hang on, nearly there. It's like a like an operation, isn't it? I wouldn't be good as a surgeon, would I? Oh gosh. Here we go. There we go. Hang on. Let's put that aside. Okay. All right. That is good. That is good. So I'll start off with the trunk. Uh, let me see. Um, Got to start. Yep. Uh, that's my hand popping out. Oh, that's my hand. Oh, um, okay. Ooh, e. 
okay uh, you'd go as far as uh, for oh yes oh yeah okay all right um, <laughs> um, I like how you go from removing uh, masking film to surgeon <laughs> see a woman of many talents okay so I want to okay it looks like I'm going to be using sienna extra dark make sure burnt sienna extra dark crikey's you think I'll be able to get that right sorry that's that's Australian crikey's ah oh, dear okay uh, let me see um Okay, uh, Sneak says, uh, you'd be fine as a surgeon, but I'm not sure about your patients. <laughs> oh, I fear for the potential patients, says Iris. Uh, Dr. Chrissy says, Kimberly, yes, yes. Uh, is that the liver or the spleen? <laughs> oh, my gosh, close enough, eh? <laughs> oh, so funny, so funny. Oh, gosh. Oh, okay, all right then. <laughs> Okay, all right, so, and I'm going to use my brushes for this one. Uh, let me see. Um, I'm going to have my light coming this way, I think, so I'll have um, my dark bits here and my light bits there. So let's just do that. I'll just put that aside. Okay, and this is the color that it's going to be. Okay. Yeah, so, um, uh, y'all, oh, I can't even say that. Uh, I can't say it. Uh, <laughs> I can't say it. Hilarious. You are, you all, <laughs> hilarious this morning, always makes uh, streams fun. Oh my gosh. Yeah, well, you see, you know, Dr. Chrissy, mate. Right? That's all I can say. Dr. Chrissy. Woman of many talents. Um, I would not get the right prescription from Dr. Chrissy. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. How funny is that? Well, you know. Okay. And I'm using um, my little Dale Rowney now. Still, folks, I still haven't found uh, this... Um, this brush still I'm on lookout I'm okay um, uh, Christine uh, uh, got to run I hear the call um, of the biddy uh, to you all okay nice to see you thanks for popping by Christine um, always a pleasure um, uh, she can't say y'all peep oh look I said it y'all y'all <laughs> so simple <laughs> Though better than her pronunciation of schedule. Schedule, not schedule. Actually, you know what's funny is that I asked my husband, I, go, I said to him, his name's Dave, and I go, I go, sweetie, I go, how do you say schedule? And he goes, schedule. And I said, oh gosh, here we go. It, and I think it's just me. I think, no, but when, no. Well, it's, you know, you say tomato. What is it? You say tomato. No, I say tomato. You say tomato. That's that's it. Um, <laughs> Sneak says, "You're old." Yeah, I'm not even going to go there. Um, um, I see you, Christine. Um, oh, okay. Uh, West Virginia, York. Oh, what's that? Someone explain. Y York. What? What's York? What is that? Someone explain. Um, sounds like the dialogue between Chris Tucker and Jackie Chan in Rush Hour. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah, it's like that, actually. Funny movie. Uh, funny movie. Um, maybe she will have it by the end of the stream. <laughs> Maybe, maybe. Um, oh, just FYI, Lockery is doing a live stream with acrylic painting this evening. Oh, wow. She's the queen of acrylics, that's for sure. Um, 
Okay, um, R-O-F-L. Rolling on the floor, <laughs> laughing. Uh, you're so funny. Oh, funny. Uh, talk. Oh, talk. Oh, sorry. Um, Kimberly, in in KY, uh, we say you. Uh, in Kentucky, we say you all. Well, there you go. We say that you all as well. Um, <laughs> oh, God. Okay, well, I know it's a southern thing, so. Um, all right. Okay, uh, what am I after? I'm after an ochre here, and I want some reds. Um, uh, Nanette is missing out on all of this funny, on all of these funny stuff. Oh, look, she's probably, oh, probably lurking. Maybe lurking? She'll pop out. Okay, and this is Burnt Sienna Shade that I'm using right now. Okay. And of course, uh, I actually should be using the other one. Let me see. Oh, Rico, hello, welcome. I haven't seen you here uh, first time. Welcome, welcome. Hi, just signed. Um, uh, hi, hi, just signed on. What brush are you using? That doesn't look like it's a Pan Pastel approved model. No, it's not. It is not. It is something that I've been playing with uh, for a very long time, and uh, they're eco brushes. Um, well. Let's just say that they're, they're makeup brushes. And no, they probably Pan Pastel wouldn't approve of these ones because look, it's causing dust, you see. So, I mean, Pan Pastels aren't supposed to do what I'm doing with these. So, um, uh, let me see. Um, okay, uh, no, they don't. Uh, they say you, oh, they say you all, y'all. Okay, Nanette, where are you? Don't hide. We don't bite. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay. Yeah, no, these brushes, um, uh, Rico, are not... Um, are, are not pan pastels. I mean, I, I think they... I think pan pastels would like us to use their products all the time, and I do all the time. But, you know, different techniques... You know, sometimes these brushes help me, um, as you can see, look, they, they help me uh, do quite a bit of detail. And I paint quite tightly, not loosely, so this is the reason why. So, um, let me see. Um, okay, Simon, so unfortunately, I'm going to need uh, to head off, Chrissy, finally was able to jump um, onto a live stream of yours, even though it was just for a short short while. Oh no, thank you so much for, uh, for, for popping by. As always, love your work, stay, stay groovy. Okay, thank you so much. And you're always welcome, you know that. Um, oh, let me see, what time is it? Oh, okay, still got a little bit of time. Okay. Um, here we go. And I'm really interested to see how this is going to turn out in pastel. Because as you guys saw, I tried it in quite a few mediums. And um, I was unsuccessful. But that was because I probably didn't... I wasn't stubborn enough how about that i wasn't stubborn enough to continue on and persevere so i think i can be blamed for that um walk outside in skivvies here today uh you'll get um exhilarated in a completely different way oh missed that one out what's that one uh skivvies oh yeah skivvies you know like polonix we call them Polonix and Skivvies. Wow. Hang on, hang on. Are we talking, what are we talking about, Skivvies? What, what? 
Okay, skivvies in Australia are polar neck jumpers where we have, you know, that's what we call them. How about that? That's what I thought you guys were talking about. Uh, Janet, hello. Uh, welcome, nice to see you here. I came, um, uh, I came uh, on late, but uh, but like to say hi. First first time catching you live. Thank you so much for popping by. It's nice to see you. Um, underwear says Barbara. <laughs> well, they're not underwear in Australia. Skivvies are. Um, yeah. Oh wow. You're, you're all teaching me stuff, which is fantastic. Um, um, let me see. Steve, no thanks, Wendy. Don't want, uh, want, don't want to pee ice cubes. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Well, there you go. Um, personal lemonade that way oh gosh <laughs> oh dear so funny what a nice way to say that Wendy isn't it <laughs> oh, God. really Wendy says Iris there you go see <laughs> really really Wendy oh, funny funny okay Actually, this bit here, oh, let me see if I can do this. This bit here is, this is sky. I sh uh, let me see. Um, uh, let me see. Um, oh, Kimberly, uh, stomach growling, time for breakfast by all. Thanks for stopping by, Kimberly. Uh, thank you so much. Um, uh, we'll hope to see you again, uh, again soon. Um, Barbara says, I just posted my butterfly painting in the Unmasked Art family. Oh, okay, wonderful. Well, I'm sure we'll all, we'll all have a look at that. Um, what kind of a butterfly? Um, uh, snow cream, but not yellow snow, <laughs> says Brenda. Um, butterfly painting, nice. Yes. Okay. Um, Iris says, uh, well, you know, uh, 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 no, no angels in a dog park. Hmm? Snow angels are in a dog park. Okay. Bye, Kim. Oh, okay. Okay. These bits here, they're supposed to be sky. Yeah, but that's okay. A lot of layers are going to happen here, so at least if I put this in now, I'll know that um, I can go. There we go. Okay. And uh, this bit here is sky as well. Um, okay. All right. Okay. All right. So that bit there is sky. It looks a bit funny there, but don't worry. When I, it'll all be, it'll be okay. When I um, or Bigfoot. Oh, okay. Hang on a sec. Okay. So um. I'm going to put some, um, let me see, some green, some greenery here. And these are all base coats, by the way. This is all, no, 
Night, night, Chrissy. Um, everyone, uh, have a great week. Thanks for popping by, Jeff. Um, <coughs> pretend tea. Yes, pretend tea. Co. Yes, very pretend tea. Could be. Coffee. Um, um, let me see, what time is it over there in Western Australia? We're about three hours in front, or four hours in front now, because uh, of daylight saving, so probably dinner time over there, I would say. In Western Australia. Um, Got to go myself and get ready for my CAT scan appointment at the doctor's. Hope it's okay. Uh, hope it's a nice, hope it's a nice cat and not angry. Uh, we'll find out in about one and a half hours. Okay. All right. Thanks, mate, for popping by. Thank you, Steve. Um, hope to see you uh, again soon. Um, if she gets the tea, if she gets the tree done, maybe we can add an additional five hundred oh, points again. We're on points again. Uh, Coke with tea. <laughs> Very funny, Coke. Hilarious. Um, mm. Okay. Um, Coke with tea. Not exactly Coke with tea, no. Coke and tea don't go. Okay. Okay. Um, uh, no, straight up. <laughs> Says Wendy. <sighs> oh, oh, how we say good luck in Italian. Oh, hang on. Take care, Steve. In Oh, okay. In boccia alla... Here we go. Uh, how we say good luck in Italian. Here we go. Hang on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this. All right. Okay. Um, in boccia alla lupo. No. In, in boccia alla lupo. Is that right? Um, tea. Okay. Taiwanese bubble milk tea. Here we go. <laughs> um. In the wolf's mouth, okay. <laughs> Tea made with uh, fermented grapes. <laughs> um, Helly, uh, now I try to ask here. Um, are there any others with um, sclerosis who have some advice about buying something to put on their pencil so I can get a better grip uh, on the pencil? Um, there are pencil grips, aren't there? Um, oh... Uh, you can buy pencil grips. I suppose um, eBay, if you Google eBay, Heli, um, what else? Um, uh, eBay, Amazon, um, yeah. Um, you said uh, lupo, right? Oh, oh, there you go. Boca is pronounced like boca. Oh, okay, let me go up again. In boca, in, <laughs> in boca a la lupo. Oh, I think I got it. Um, would the triangle pencil grips help you? Um, maybe. Mm, that's a good idea, Wendy. Uh, tea, tea with beer. <laughs> tea with beer. Uh, no, not tea with, tea with beer. But um, I'm going to have another sip of that tea again, though, in a minute. I think I need it. Um, okay, putting these aside now, they're starting to, here we go. Uh, uh, raw, raw, um, let me see. Um, oh, g'day Shannon, how you going? Nice to see you here. You're up late, Shannon. Um, uh, well done, extra 100 points. Yeehaw, there you go, I got it. <laughs> Okay, um, oh, uh, uh, what is that, um, 
inte... Mm. Wendy says, uh, you know, if it, if it as sees or church, she can't pronounce it properly. I just saw that. <laughs> uh, hmm, maybe we ought to just have a tea session with Chrissy one day. Oh, yeah, you'd love to have my tea sessions. Oh, yes, definitely. Well, actually, Wendy and I had a tea session once on a live stream. Although it wasn't tea, it was grape juice, by the way. So there you go. That was a scream. Man, I enjoyed myself on that day. That was so funny. That was hilarious. That was hilarious. Mate, if you want to see um, Wendy having a good time, that was a, t that was a time. <laughs> oh, okay. Um... Hmm. Uh, let me see. Maybe we ought to just have a tea. Oh, that's right. That's right. We've already done that. Um, um, they are like these plastic things uh, that are used uh, with younger children to help them grip pencils when they are learning to write. Um, just do a search for pencil grips or a triangle pencil grip. Yeah, I reckon Amazon or eBay would have those for sure. Easily for sure. Okay. I'm just having a look at my reference. Uh. Okay. These are in the way. Here we go. Um, hmm, I think I need something lighter here. There we go, that's better. So yeah, just blocking, because then I'll probably just do details with pastel pencils, or maybe even colored pencils. So watch this space. Um, maybe we should do a drunk water color stream. Uh, that way, uh, it doesn't matter how bad it looks, because at some point, you just don't care. <laughs> Oh, that's so funny. Yeah, I always wondered about uh, those grips, plus how kid how kids' pencils are uh, fatter, but kids have tiny hands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, Wendy, that would be fun. We should do that. Have some grape juice. We'll have some grape juice. How about that? And, of course, for me, it's morning, and for you, it's going to be evening, so it's okay. So, you know, I suppose, look, you know, it's 12 o'clock somewhere in another country somewhere so that doesn't matter um or maybe just do a drunk stream without ruining any of your art supplies <laughs> oh okay all right okay funny all right okay i'm gonna do this other tree now and that there I'm going to use a very one of my thin brushes. Let me see. Um, I was thinking of a wine and watercolor event. Uh, just an idea uh, like a, a wine promo event. Oh, yeah. Well, you know what? I'm not far from wine country. Actually, uh, Pakolban, Pakolban is the is the region. Hunter Valley is... Well, that's the wine region. But anyway, I'm... I'm probably about 50 minutes drive from um, the wineries. Uh, let me see. Um, sip? That sounds wrong. Oh, hang on. Uh, maybe you should pick a day and start drinking early, then do a live later in the evening. That way you have no excuse. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, sip? That sounds wrong. <laughs> when do you drink? Yes. Painting using wine and beer, that sounds like an idea. Okay, oh no, but you should, uh, in all seriousness, folks, it, it was an informative uh, stream, but um, uh, we were having fun as well, so. Um, Wendy had no intention of drinking at the time. I mean, wine. Yeah, didn't have any intention, but you know what happens when um, she gets mixed up with me. Naughty things. 
Um, okay. Here we go. Okay. Um, I'm just having a look at my reference. If I can find it. There we go. All right. Um, oh, those trees are are very um, are very designs and arty, Chrissy. I like that style. Uh, for you. Oh, okay. These are real trees, by the way. Um, Chrissy's, uh, Chrissy's always, Chrissy always and influence. Mm. Chrissy, um, would the flying chairs have the same color wings uh, or all different colors? No, the, um, this is, this is what they're going to look like. Let me just, get, let me just pull that up on screen again. They're going to be purple. That's what they're going to be. They're going to be purple. I'll leave this up there so you can actually see. Um, how about that? Um, uh, d uh, uh, let me see. Uh, did you see flying chairs during uh, that stream with Wendy? Is that how this piece came to be? No, it's not. No, 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 no. Not at all, actually. Not at all. Um, we were talking about... Oh, gosh. We were... Um, it was like a trivia type of um, a stream and we were talking about art and it like a like a guessing competition and um, I failed dismally um, because I'm not as technical everything is a thingy you know <laughs> everything is a thingy um, oh purple wings yes um, yeah she came up with um, this before we, <laughs> before we met oh okay um, oh um, so she tells you it <laughs> Okay. Yeah, there's no way I'm going to finish this. There's no way I'm going to finish this on stream. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. Imagine getting home one day and seeing your chairs having wings and flying. Oh, yes. See, in Chrissy's world, anything happens. Um, <laughs> what's this? She goes. She. Uh, Wendy says uh, she was uh, flighty. Oh, that's right. Before, <laughs> I just highlighted it for her. Okay. Ah, <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. Flighty. That's right. Flighty. Um, hang on. All right. Actually, there's um. Oh no, better not. All right. Here we go. Um. Let me see. Um. Let me see. Hey, I had many. I had many night where I saw flying everything. Co. Oh, to be twenty-two again. Um, uh, Co. Chrissy's world of magic. No Harry Potter <laughs> included. Oh my gosh, so funny. Um, okay. Uh, must be common trait of, of us great girls. Yes, 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 yes. Funny. Okay, all right, hang on, I just need to, all right, okay, all right, so, this is by no means, the trees aren't even finished, I'm not even going to go into detail with this, but um, I might just fix up the clouds there, just a little bit there, but that's about it. Great girls, new music band. <laughs> ah, so many comedians. 
Okay. looks funny there it looks like clouds are stuck in the um in the tree i will fix this i promise i will fix this haha <laughs> take off from the movie grease uh, let me see um uh, pink girls i think they were called um says wendy uh live action sitcom yes oh look uh for sure uh great people of the universe unite there you go see so see even paulo likes it uh uh Paulo likes um, um, a bit of um, grape juice as well. Can everyone have a good day? Um, I have two dogs who would like a walk now. Okay, thank you so much, Helly, for um, for popping by. Um, always a pleasure. Um, live, yeah, okay. Take care, okay. All right, so. Okay, all right. This is all going to be defined and fixed up I promise I promise I promise all right okay let me see I think this is all I can do at this point I think I can uh, I think this is all I can do um, well, I might just oh hang on just let me fix this a little bit here um, There'll be um, areas here where this is, there's got a gap here and a gap there. Uh, if anyone finds a Dela, can someone help me? If so, if someone finds a Dela Rowney, look, it's a Dela Rowney um, eighth of an inch. If anyone, if I know Wendy's been looking. I know Wendy's been looking. I know. It, but you just don't know. In your tra where people that look for art supplies. If you ever come across it, say, oh, Chrissy wants one of these. Just let me know. Message me somehow. Let me know. All right. Okay. Um, Wendy says, uh, Chrissy, you should think about making an art group. Making an art group? Uh, two hours of streaming already. Um, seriously, we are back to the brush again. <laughs> Time flies, just like those chairs. <laughs> oh, okay. oh, my. oh, Iris, so, so funny, so funny. Um, get her, Wendy, get her. <laughs> Oh, in Harry Potter's world, uh, you would use a wand. In Chrissy's world, you would use a magic brush. <laughs> oh, so funny. You guys are so funny. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Well, look, now, I'll have to... I might just call this a stream, I think. Um, but look, look what we've done. We've actually... Well, we've achieved something here. Um, haven't we? We've achieved... A sky, a sky, a couple of trees. Um, yeah, I think so. I mean, you know, like I've actually been talking and I've been working at the same time. So that's pretty good for me. Um, all right. So what I might do is I might just call it, um, uh, call it a stream. Um, and I just wanted to say, hang on. We have achieved more progress on a painting than any other painting in recent times. Two thousand points yes two thousand points yes the sky is wonderfully done okay thank you co <laughs> uh look thank you all so so much um uh we'll be live streaming again next wednesday um let me see uh yep a lot has been done she is surprised that she did art in an art stream <laughs> oh my god <laughs> Um, the drawing works. Uh, nice. Uh, she multitasks. There you go, Sneaks. That's it. Thank you, Chrissy. That was fun. Well, look, all right then. Look, I just, oh, hang on, let me see. Um, 